amazing. Is that for real? And then I have the uh, iMovie running also. So multitasking. Okay. So if you look here, I have a tutorial on it already. I have to replace the card and also uh, where I bought it. So this one is, yeah, from Allen Computer International. So this one's the one I put in mine, all right? So this is Yosemite 10.10.1. And this is the Wi-Fi. So they will say third-party wireless card. And if you go I/O Registry Explorer, uh, EN1, and you will see Broadcom 4360. That is the plugin. This is uh, the uh, Product number is 4357. There's two files we need to do. System, library, extension. Okay. So you drag that one outside. So I.O. Go all the way to I.O. So you drag this one outside, like this. And then you also drag out the Bluetooth. Where is that? I.O. Bluetooth family. This one too. Drag it outside, all right? You're going to edit it, and then you're going to install it. Uh, so this is mine. But anyway, you're going to do the same thing. Show package content, content, go to plug in, and 4360K text, okay? Show package content again. So now we open info. So if you look here, if you open yours, you will not see this number. So what you do is to highlight whatever one line, okay, out in the C, and then you go down one line, and you do out in it, out in it V. It will copy and paste, and then you're gonna change whatever to 57 like that. Alright. Alright, so So when it's done you make sure your forty three fifty seven is in there and you do out in it A L T S you will save it. So this is one I O Wi Fi eight zero two one one family. So the next one you want is the Bluetooth family, right? Same thing. Show package contents. Plug in. Now, Broadcom Bluetooth host. This is the one you want. USB transport kex. Show package content. And if you get the exactly the same one, uh, the BCM 943225HMB, the ID of this one, you need to add this whole thing. Alright? So remember, the key, and then we'll end with the dash dictation, D-I-C-T. So what you need to do is you just pick up this one you will not have it in your your kex. So what you do is you take one of these guys like this. 
okay out in the sea let's copy and then you make a space and alternate V okay so now you have this whole thing in here it's Broadcom 217D OA 5C is equal in uh, decimal is 2652 So if you put here, clear this. I said clear. Where's the clear? Clear is here. So if you put, uh, if you put the vendor ID OA5C, right? So put zero A five C, and then you change to decimal. It's 2652 right here. See that? 2652, that's render ID. So, if, and then later, you, when you want to put uh, to convert the hex, so clear this. So, 217D base 10 is 8573. So, 8573 so now you create a new PID product ID 217D uh, and uh, the vendor ID after you're done with that alternate S and then close it and what do you use to install? The best one to you is Kex Helper. So just drag uh, the one you just added it. And Bluetooth. Where is it? Where's the Bluetooth family? Yeah. All right. And then just type in the password. Da -da -da -da. And then install. All right. Anyway, I already installed mine, so I'm not going to install that. All right. Broadcom. Uh, Bluetooth. Open it up. So. First thing it sees, this one is my uh, Bluetooth mouse, just turn it on, pair, okay, so now the mouse is working, now this one is the uh, 30 pin iPod dock. It. Good. Now, <coughs> this one right here. Use the headphones. Okay. So now all three of them, all three, are connected. Okay, so the mouse, the headphones, and the 30 pin speaker uh, adapter. This one is the Bluetooth. Two one seven D O A five C. Okay.